Hello everyone and uh, thanks for joining us today for this uh, tutorial on how to light a cigar and how to go about handling yourself in public uh, when you are smoking uh, a cigar. So this episode is uh, brought to you by our puffpuffcigars.com, a new website available in three languages, English, French and Spanish and much more content to come very soon. Before we start again guys, Shout out to everyone helping us on this video and please follow us on Instagram, any social media you like and on, on YouTube channel specifically. So uh, without any further ado, let's just start. How to light a cigar. So many cigars come in phone, especially those that are not Cubans. Uh, when you go ahead and, and buy a cigar, they'll come in, a, in this sort of shape and this packaging in here. So what you want to do is when you walk into a humidor uh, or when you walk into buy, buy a cigar from a tobacconist, obviously, this is the best way to buy cigars. Uh, they'll probably ask you and, and tell you how do you like it. You like it strong, you like it mild, uh, you like it with flavors, you like it any way you like. So basically, they'll, they'll suggest you a cigar. So when that cigar is in your hands, first thing you got to do is that try to feel a little bit the cigar. Don't press too hard. Just feel a little bit and see if you feel any knots. Uh, it's important because this will, will make your life a bit miserable while smoking because you'll be uh, trying to uh, puff in and it will be have a, you, you'll have a lot of a lot of difficulties. So feel it a little bit, see if it's a little bit spongy. It cannot be too spongy and it cannot be too hard. So just a little bit. Uh, once you got that out of the way, then you get your cigar and you walk out of the store to enjoy. And there's a lot of people, guys, um, a mooch. I don't know if you guys know what a mooch is. A mooch is, is the guy that walking into a place, not feeling basically he knows everything, uh, takes out a cigar, start pressing everywhere and hard and squeeze and all that, and then smell the cigar with the wrapper on. I mean, <laughs> that's a mistake, and you look basically you ridicule yourself. Don't do that. Just if you don't know, ask. It's better that you ask than you make yourself look like a fool. So we got the cigar. We're removing it out of the wrapper. We're smelling it. Where this is basically the foot of the cigar. The smell is amazing. So um, you look at the cigar and then you look at the, at the tip. You'll notice there's a cap and there's some lines. I'll show you guys here. There is a line basically indicating if you see here where to cut. You're gonna grab your cutter. And it's important to make sure you're on the line. Don't go too, too much underneath that line. You just want to shave off the cap. Boom. See? Simple. What I just did, I'll show you guys. It's the cap. It was removed very easily. And you can see it in your hand and you can feel it. So once that's done, you make sure you remove any residues that you have on top. You don't want these to come in your mouth, just clean it up a little bit. And you do yourself a pre-draw test. Amazing. The draw on this will be great. You feel it, there's actually the air circulating, going in and out. Now, this is, uh, now how, presentation of the cigar is very important. Uh, when it comes to you, if you go to a, like a, basically a cigar lounge, whatever, that, they'll present it to you in that way. They'll give you matches, They'll give you wooden stick, which is a cedar wooden stick, and they'll present you with a cigar. The proper way of lighting the cigar is obviously with the stick. You would uh, light the match, light the stick, and go over the cigar. So we'll get to that a bit later. Now, also the other easy way to do it, and this is basically how I do it. I don't really, really do that pretty much on that, but when you enjoy, I'd like to do this. Do you have a single torch light? And you have a triple or dual torch. Now, depending on the gauge, what's the gauge? The gauge is, we look at it here, it's basically this part here. How big is that gauge? Now, this is a 52, uh, or perhaps 54, but I believe, I believe it's a 52 here. 52, 54, probably. If you are above that and you are the 56 gauge, which is much wider, Suggested to people to use a dual torch to light up the cigar. Honestly, 
I don't do it. I like to take my time on my dual torch and burn the face of the cigar and start. So some people will, will tell you, oh, this is a big cigar, a 56. You might want to use a dual and a triple. That is true. You can, but you can also go with a single torch and just take your time and burn the face of the cigar easily. What you want to do is toast it first and then light it. So the, what we're going to do, the next step here is that we are going to light that cigar. So that All right, guys. So we got uh, set up outside here to uh, go ahead and uh, show you how to light a cigar. And it's important how you start puffing it. So we're removing the wrapper out of the cigar. And the first thing you want to do is start lighting your cigar. Don't put it in your mouth yet. Okay, suggestion. Actually, what you need to do is you go ahead and you start lighting. Now, important that you do not put the lighter straight on the cigar. What we're doing is that we are, we call that toasting. Okay, so the face of the cigar, what I'm trying to do here is I'm trying to burn it evenly. All right, and you can see my hand, you can notice it's actually in a circle uh, motion. And I just keep burning, burning until I see actually all the redness on the face comes up. So we don't want to see those, uh, you can say dark spots or, 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 you know, you know when it's burning, you can see dark spot. We don't want, we want that ashy colory uh, and, and red. All right, so I'm, I'm keep doing it. You're going to take your time. Take your time to show you a preview. You see, we have kind of an equal uh, light here. I'm going to keep going a little bit here. And once that ready, we're going to, what well, first thing you're going to do here, we're going to do a demonstration. The first puff that you need to do is out, not take it in. That's the first, you push it out. Then you put it back in your mouth. You take a draw. And I noticed it's actually red in here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to give him one more. Here we go. And the light, the cigar is lit. That's it. And important guys, do not inhale. The whole purpose of a cigar is not for you to inhale. What you need to do is take the smoke in, keep it in your mouth, and just, just picture yourself actually like drinking from a straw. All right, just take the smoke in, have it in your mouth, wait a little bit, you know, it's just to sink in so you get all the flavors of the cigars so you can enjoy. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you have any questions, you have any comments, please put them on that... Uh, on the tutorial comments on this channel and we'll we'll answer you uh, if we need to do another video to, to go deep down to other uh, suggestions we'll do it notice one thing guys also we did not use the wooden stick outside with the wind not recommended uh, usually we do this into a lounge in the closed space uh, or, or there's no wind uh, obviously as you can see winter so uh, we are here uh, smoking outside so we're using uh, the, the single torch as I uh, as I showed you for this 54 ring gauge Thank you. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you follow us. Make sure you visit our website. Uh, available in three uh, three languages. And uh, we're uh, we can't wait for your comments. Thank you.